We have a president who loves sniffing small children. Whenever he gets a chance, he will go down there and smell them right in front of their parents. Joe Biden cannot keep his nose off of small kids. And normally you tell a politician, hey, correct this behavior because of how it looks. But Joe Biden has made no efforts to do it. He thinks he's better than you. He thinks he doesn't have to listen to you or his advisors. And he thinks he can smell you whenever he wants. Take a look. Oh, no. He's done it again. Now, the very important thing I told my daughter and granddaughters, no serious guys in your 30s. Okay. Right? <laughs> no what? No serious guys in your 30s. Oh, keep that in mind. At least. At least. Yeah, that's not Ooh. creepy at all, is it? <laughs> Getting into a young girl's personal space and telling her not to have any boyfriends until she's 30. And look at how the alarmed Secret Service dude tries to stop this being taped once he sees that Joe has reverted back to this peculiar behaviour. Because this is nothing new. Indeed, creepy Joe being handsy, inappropriate and invading people's personal space was something the US media used to note. Even the far-left CNN used to report on his weird antics. Would not have been micro-analyzed if it hadn't been for all the other overly handy Biden moments. Critics collect them. Times when he gently rearranges a young girl's hair and whispers in her ear, then rearranges some more. There's nothing pervy here. The VP knows he's on camera at these swearing-in ceremonies, and the parents are right there as he leans in for a kiss. <laughs> Now, we talk about the sniffing, but it's not just the sniffing. It's the touching, the caressing, the, <laughs> uh, hey, look, let's take a picture over here. Then his hand goes to the chest of the young girl. And it would be fine if it was like once and then he learned from it. But this is Joe Biden just two days later after he told a girl, hey, no boyfriends till you're 30 years old, huh? Meanwhile, Hunter Biden is doing whatever he's doing with 15, 16, 17-year-olds. He's on camera doing it. Why doesn't he give his son advice? on how to act around women instead of giving our young children advice on how to act around Joe. Watch what he did when he got to Oregon. He's supposed to be eating ice cream and talking about the economy. He goes in and sniffs two more girls. The sniffer strikes back. Kevin, Kevin, go down. Oops, he sniffed it again, got lost in her hair, he's not that innocent. All right, pre-order the new one-hour comedy special, I make fun of Joe Biden in it, and you are going to be glad you did.